peace to the true ones. This is part two because I didn't see this. If I saw this, if I saw this, I would have. If I saw this, man, I would have kept going. The fuck? <laughs> this motherfucker said, as a black woman, Latino woman, you are God. You were first. All life force comes from you. This also means you outnumber the man. I don't know why that means that, but okay, we're going to do this according to his logic, okay? Then he said, God, you you uh the you outnumber the man slash God's ten to one. So this is why polygyny was practiced or polygyny, however the motherfucker would want to say it, okay? Um, polygyny. I don't even think he spelled it right. Is any polygyny? Polygyny. Yeah, he missing a Y. Um, after a G, it says. So this is why. Poly- I, but I don't. I don't care about that kind of stuff because, I mean, spelling matters. But I still know what you meant. You know what I mean? I still know what you meant. But it said. What he say? He said. So this is why polygyny was practiced. You say you don't want to share. You're selfish ways must be disintegrated if you if we are to rise this nigga is saying that meanwhile people who do not subscribe to this shit have risen i have risen i'm in the sky i'm burning shit up i'm stumping on his ass i'm stumping on motherfuckers like i done turned everybody against this motherfucker well every true one the bots is still following him but he always tell you it's him against the world right I told him last year, last summer, I was going to turn the, the world against him, right? And that all he would have left was bot followers, right? That's what I told him. Go back in the video. I already told him all this, right? So everything I told him that was going to happen to him happened. Um, so people who like me who have risen, individuals, true ones like me who have risen, don't subscribe to none of this shit. And we know... What all this shit is, is just manipulation. And that's what I told you, that I was about to line up each and every one of you manipulating women, hating bitches to get knocked down, okay? To get stepped on, okay? Because this is pure manipulation. Even if it was 10 to 1, it was 10 more women to the, to one male or man, Um, how does that affect the men? It's more women than men. How does that negatively affect a man? And why is a woman selfish? Because she don't want to be with a whole bunch of women and you. And you have to freak. you. Well, let me put it this way. Remember that not every individual on this planet is what you are. Some people are asexual. Some people are androgynous. Some people didn't come here to create the way that you want them to create. They came to create other things, not children. They came to create something that will further evolution in a different way. And they don't want to have sex period. And some people don't want to be with a man. And that's completely fine. Cause two women can procreate with themselves. And if a man want to be gay and be with another man, that's okay. With, that's their business. How is somebody else's sexuality and what they do hurting other people? If anything, it'll hurt them themselves, right? If it was really bad, it would hurt them. But last time I checked, diseases go in both sexes and both sexualities. So your sexuality ain't got shit to do with you getting a disease personally. Because... You can get the same thing no matter what you claim to be, sexual preference wise. So this ten to one shit don't matter because not everybody want a man, and that's a part of divine order as well. Because not everybody and everything was created to do the same things and be the exact same way. The great mother and father, they're magnificent and they explored everything. You you are no one to tell anybody what's going to be disintegrated, nigga. 
You backwards as fuck. So women are selfish because they're taking their power back. Hmm. And their selfish ways must be disintegrated because they are taking their power back from you so that they can rise. But you're telling them that if they don't share their 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 essence with you and however many you how many however many women you want, they selfish, but they want to keep themselves sacred and clean. So that they can rise. You see how see how they flip and flop and flip and switch? <laughs> None of this shit is divine order. If okay, if it was all women in the beginning before, and it was, even me as the great father, I started out as a uh as a um in a feminine vessel while I went dragon, and then my fir- my first human vessel was a feminine vessel, but I was still the great father God. I didn't get my male vessel until the shift happened and the one of the X chromosomes turned into the Y because I chose to evolve that way. Me, I chose to shift the X into the Y so that my phallus was on the outside instead of the inside because when I was in a feminine vessel, I still had my penis. It was just on the inside. Just as it is now in my feminine vessel, my penis is on the inside and I can have soul sex with my wife on the inside of our bodies and we can create children like that not only that but women can create children through parthenogenesis and i'm not speaking on a belief i'm speaking i'm speaking on a fact because we have a daughter named amina marie so and she's being protected from this world let that sink in So all you motherfuckers, y'all don't know shit. Nothing. Everything has is everything is when it's in balance, everything is perfect. And when it goes out of balance, this is what happens: the apocalypse, and the great mother and father come back and they put it back in divine order. This shit is not divine order. We're supposed to be. See, let me tell you about these motherfuckers. He called himself a revolutionary, right? What is a revolution? What is to revolve? To go into a circle, right? When you revolve around something, you go into a circle around it, right? So you go into the same cycle. You keep revolving. You keep... See, to be revolutionary is to go around in a circle, not changing. It's just you're in this continual cycle, which is called the Kali Yuga, which is being destroyed right now. That's to be revolutionary. The thing is, you're supposed to be evolutionary, It's evolutionary, not revolutionary. Evolutionary is to create change. Evolution is to change. Revolution is to stay the same and go in a, in a circle like a fucking uh, maniac. Expecting things to change, but keep going in the same circle. Expecting different results. That's insanity. These are these people are insane. He wants to go back into ancient times with polygyny. When shit was barbaric and when the fall first happened. That's when polygyny started. When, when when the fall happened. We didn't do this shit when we were in our highest selves. This was shit. This this shit. Polygyny and polygamy started when we was in our. When we was at our lowest. <laughs> That's why it started. Because we was low. We was low fighting each other. And you know what the war was about? The great mother. That's what the war is about. The fall of us, turning your back on God and everybody trying to sit on the throne, but who should? But God, God allowed it. And we was in the streets warring, saying for the mother, you know, like on some shit like you see on Braveheart. And it was women warriors everywhere. Men too, but women, the Kendaki, the Ashanti, the Amazonians. It go it goes ain't more ancient than them. We was fighting fiercely. We're mighty. We were the warriors too. Not just Shaka Zulu and them. Go read about the women warriors fucking shit up. Taking down armies. And y'all listen to these type of niggas. That ain't got no no they ain't they you know what they got? They got gang member blood. They ain't got warrior blood. That's what they got. They think gang members is warriors. And that that's not no disrespect to all gang members, because some of them is, but you, it's a lot of bitch-ass gang members, okay? 
All right? There's some stand-up ones and some bitch-ass ones. Warrior blood is different. You can have the same type of fire and be a gang member, but warrior blood, they go stand ten toes no matter what from beginning to end with the truth. The truth lift them up. The truth is their pedestal. Not some lies to manipulate and finesse women so you can fill yourself up energetically and let them be your strength. So you want a whole, you want a whole uh, house full of women charging you up because you're not God enough to charge yourself. Remember in your post when you said the strength? Ain't that what you said? It's somewhere around this motherfucker, ain't it? Here it go. Here it go. Monogamy drains the warrior out of the God. <laughs> I kill everybody over my wife. Y'all got me fucked up. If anything, being married to my wife made me even more vicious. Because I'm not going to let nothing happen to her or our children. So, uh, <laughs> these motherfuckers is backwards, yo. They backwards, man. Trying to teach a whole bunch of people lies, yo. This shit is fucking disgusting, yo. Look at all the manipulation in this. This is this is manipulation one on one. Monogamy drains the warrior out of the god. He is designed to hunt, con- to conquer, to provide, to protect. He was created by the black woman, supreme goddess, to design uh, to design the cosmos. Oh, that's what he's saying. Okay, okay, he's saying he was created by the black woman. Oh, Supreme Goddess to design it. No, the Great Mother designed the cosmos, man. The Great Father just gave her the energy to do it. These motherfuckers see the more, the more I read it, the even, the even more don't make no more sense. I just find more lies. I just find more lies. The Supreme Goddess, okay, she designed the cosmos before the man even. Came into existence. (laughs) She already had the layout. He just gave her the energy. She already had the blueprint. He just gave her the energy. She created him to give her the energy back. To be her energy supply. For for her. You know. So she, she didn't have to do all the work. Okay. They can co create together now. She took that part of creation out of her and gave it to me so that she didn't have to do all the work. She had a a helper. Who could sustain themselves. And was a generator as well. Designed to love and protect her. And their children. And she does the same. You play chess, don't the uh, queen protect the king? Well, it's vice versa in in, in, uh, omniversal law. It goes both ways. They protect each other because the great mother is fierce. She'll pop on your ass like nobody else. Quickly, quicker than me. She'll pop up on you quicker than me. I'll tell you that. I have a lot of fire. She more analytical. I'll be having a fire, yo. But she'll pop up on you quickly as well. Because she see it coming at years away. She see it coming. These motherfuckers get on my nerves, y'all. Peace to the true ones.